So I'll read it for you boys and then we can react. I'll pause a couple of times. The title, why is it so hard to be friends with a man? So we have a 21 <laughs> year old female here asking why it's so hard to be friends with a man. So Manic, how about you answer first? Why is it hard for a 21 year old female to be platonic friends with a man? Because every time I get real, they, they just start crying. Oh, like what? Like give an example. <laughs> Bro, I do. I swear. Whenever they have issues at all, they come straight to you. They, they, they don't even. And then I'm just like, bro, could you not figure this out yourself? Now, I, I think there's a point there to be made. When women will go to women to commiserate about their feelings. And then they go to men, even their male friends, and they expect the same female treatment, right? So oh, a woman yeah. goes to a man and says, you know, I got a problem. This 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 guy this guy I want to date, he's like sleeping with me, but he's not committing to me. You can fix her problem. Don't talk to him anymore. Don't. But she doesn't want to hear that. She doesn't want a solution. She wants her girlfriends and your friend. She sees you as a girlfriend, like, you know, like a girl girlfriend, like, uh, you know, one of these females to so just talk shit on him for 30 minutes and make her feel better. Yeah, she just want her feelings yeah. validated. Yeah. Whereas a man, when he brings up problems with a friend, typically he's looking for a solution. Very rarely. It, it's happened like four times the past couple of years. I had a friend approach me with a problem. And it's stuff like there's no there's no easy solution. But I can they don't want to ask for it. But they just kind of want that their feelings to be validated. Right? Like, yeah, dude, it, it does suck that, you know, your your dad got gunned down. I, there's nothing, you know, nothing that's going to bring him back. But that sucks, man. I'm here for you. That kind of stuff. But that doesn't happen. That happens like once a blue moon. Not even... That happens once a Kush moon. For women, it happens every time they hang out with their friends. But Yidis, let me ask you, why is it hard for a woman to be friends with a man? Well, well they know this. Uh, they try to act all gullible, or they try to act gullible. They know what the man wants at the end. If eventually, uh, the male friend, quote-unquote, is going to bring up the A, hey, you know, when a uh, Want to do some ET? Yeah, pretty much. And she's like, "Oh no, I should see you as a brother." And like, what <laughs> the hell? Like, no. And the fact that she knows that she's uh, emo uh, emotionally manipulating these guys that are waiting in line just to hope that one day, and they're willing to wait for years, that she will give them that uh, access to the Puniti. I think there's two I think there's two situations. One, the woman willingly and knowingly manipulates a guy, but the other is a woman is honestly friends with the dude, and the dude does have feelings for her, but the guy's typically not confident and he's weak. Ergo why he has female friends. And so he's too nervous to like ask her out on a date or like pursue her romantically. I see it all the time. I see it all the time. If he pursued her romantically after like a month long friendship, we're getting to know each other. She'd probably say yes, but he is so nervous about losing my friendship. He won't do it. And then a confident man asks her out and she says, yes, because she doesn't think the man has feelings for her. So it kind of, the, the, the blame on those situations kind of goes on the man, right? So switching, why would a man, why, why would man not have friends with a woman? Like for me, I say it like this. Why would I have female friends? What would I get from it? Cause I'm not, it's, I don't have unlimited time. I can't be friends with everybody. You ever have, a relationship goes sour, and the girl says, "Well, we could still be friends." I'm, I'm like, "Nah, nah, nah, we can't." <laughs> nah. Okay, no. What, what, like what? I'm gonna spend time with my ex and have her talk about all the dudes refitting her instead of like calling up my boys and hanging out. No, nah, that's not that's not worth it. I'm comparing the time I spend with a woman to the time I spend with my friends, good yes. friends, my comrades, right, my brothers. Yeah. I, yeah. What, what the only thing she, the only thing a woman could bring that my boys can't is puniti. So if there's gonna be no puniti, <laughs> like what am I? Like what are we gonna do? I'm gonna take her to the range and like talk about her shot spread. No, a lot of noises scare her. What am I gonna do? Take her on, take her to the museum and and talk about the genetic history of different types of fish. No, she doesn't know shit about that. So like no puniti, no kind of intellectual conversations. I'm interested in. What's the point? There, yeah. there is none. When you're with your boys, you're always doing something productive. But if you have a female friend, you're her therapist. Yeah. And like, what, what, if you're hanging out with dudes, it's like guaranteed fun. It's less risk. Hang out with the chick. Uh, you might get me too one day. Who knows? That's a big thing. Yeah. I, I'm trying to think of the woman I was 
friends friendly with, I had zero sexual attraction to them. And as soon as we weren't friends at convenience anymore, I moved away or I got a different job. We stopped talking. That's how it is. Well, let's get to the post. I'm a 21 year old female. And as much as I would like a male friend, it's just impossible. I have female <laughs> friends, but I don't really share the same interests with them, but we can relate on other things. I'd be chilling with a guy by just being nice and automatically think I must be into them. No, they're into you. Uh, uh, men don't need confirmation that you're into them. If you're single and you're hanging out with them and a man's into you, he's going to push for a relationship. Yep. Because he's into you. And so he doesn't want to have a female friend who's single and dating other guys. When he's into you, you have stuff in common. And it's just whatever. She says, I don't even know how to flirt because if I was attracted to them, I'd basically be very shy. Yeah, it's not up to you to flirt. The man takes the lead. I've I've had like a handful of women flirt with me in my life. They're not like that. So that's annoying. And then I'd have guy friends. They start talking with a girl and dating and I have to keep my distance just out of respect for the for the girl. It'd be weird just to hang out with a guy one on one when he's dating someone. I also noticed that throughout the DMs I've received on countless social media apps, the conversation goes, hey, how are you? Then after five minutes, can I see your tits? So wait, you're trying to find friends as a woman on social media where your profile is probably showcasing your tits and you're surprised? <laughs> yep. Okay. Um, none of my profiles show or prove that I'm horny or willing to trade nudes. So I don't know where this is coming from. Well, it's social media. Horny dudes lose nothing from asking for your tits. And I would say if, if I knew a girl who made a male friend and she was talking about how he's honest and all this stuff online, they want to meet up. I'm like, girl, you're going to get sex trafficked. Stop that. She says, it's like it's impossible for them to be friends with someone who was the opposite gender. And it's annoying. No, there's simps out there. They, they don't, they're not confident enough to approach you, but is it you, it's a problem. You don't want to be friends with unattractive men. Why is that? I don't want to be looked at as a sex object. If that makes sense. Well, then then transition to a man. That's your number one goal. But I most likely will because I'm a woman with a vagina. There's more things to talk about than what I look like naked. This is just so weird to me. I wonder if there's men out there who aren't like that and hopefully I meet a friend. I honestly respect you guys. I really do. Why do you need a male friend so bad? Why? Why? Like she said she doesn't have the same interests as her friends. Okay. Go to where you find your interests. Let's say she's a different girl. I'm not like other girls and she's into, she's into board gaming. Go to the board game store. Make friends with the girls there. Easy. Why do you need a male friend? You're not entitled. You are not. You do not deserve a man's friendship. Same way he doesn't deserve your puniti. You are not entitled. You do not deserve a man's friendship. Male friendship is. Male friendship to me is infinitely more valuable than female friendship. I agree. I can call up one. I can call up about three guys. I got kicked out of my house. I'm poor. I'm about to suck a dick for a Dr Pepper outside the Seven Eleven, and they would buy a ticket that night, fly over, and, and help me out. Oh yeah. No, I don't have a single woman in my life that would do that. No, hell, I'd be surprised if my own mother would do that. <laughs> it's always your your homeboys that willing to go the extra mile. Believe me, I helped out friends in need. And they help me out in the all right, male friends. The Manic, female friends, they'd be like, that's crazy. Manic, why do you think this woman's obsessed with getting a male friend? I I think she just wants to push somebody around, honestly. I say, yeah, yeah, oh, keep going. Because they like she, she knows that they will, you know, the the certain archetype of men will just allow her to just talk about whatever she wants and then inconvenience him as much as she wants and he won't push back. Here we go. Here's a, here's a simple. It says, I actually like having female friends, but I'm also more in touch with my emotions. So you're a, you got <laughs> like a woman. Okay. Ugh. Talking to guys, woman, I'm over in a relationship about how I'm actually feeling without just saying I'm fine or I'm all right is impossible. Um, because you don't have any strong male friends. If I asked, if I was hanging out with my friends, I said, how are you doing, man? And he was miserable. He would tell me the truth. But men will put up a wall to people they don't think care about them. You're an emotional dude with a lot of female friends. I don't think you have any strong male friendships. That's how you want to live your life. That's okay. He says, 
Female friends you can actually talk to in a meaningful way where you can express emotions in a way with someone that can relate to that expression. <laughs> what? It's, it's, it's like girls say, why are all guys douchebags that leave me filled with zinc after the first night? That talks about the men you choose. Okay, this guy's talking about the men in his life that he thinks he's friends with. They don't care about you. Um, so you choose women. And you think the women are telling him the truth? Okay. He says... Some of the best advice I've ever received are from women who are my close friends with whom I hold a dear friendship that is not about sexual experiences. Well, do, I, you know, any advice you get from them resulted in you not having any strong male friendships. So maybe you're just a turbo beta or orbiter. Maybe this dude is actually orbiting between eight women at the same time. So he stays in the same place and doesn't move forward with anything. That's very <laughs> awesome. Okay, one more comment. It'll be fun. Someone just said, try to find a gay dude. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, find a gay guy. Yeah, pretty much. That's a solution right there. This guy says, the trick is to try to find guys who are too shy to make the first move. Then it doesn't matter if they're attracted to you. Yeah, that's yeah. – abuse <laughs> a man attracted to you who doesn't know how to talk to women. That's actual advice that a man gave here. Yeah, everybody that, in this thread's pathetic. Huh? Yeah. Find a guy who's too shy to make the first move and put him in the friend zone where he suffers. And then, yeah, you have a male friend. Yay. Yeah. Do you make your friends suffer needlessly? So then she just wants a tool to use. Not really his friend. Not his lover. He's just a an orbiter. Satellite. Useless. Yeah. I, I, I bring this down to just she just want male attention pretty much. Yeah. That's what it all is. I want male attention without giving up Puniti. I also don't want to commit to one man because I want to be a boss. Okay. Then enjoy your plethora of hags telling you you're a queen. <laughs>